Drive, where even more DUI crackdown preparations are underway. Hello, Christina. Hey, Reg and Mary, by the way, fans here are jubilant tonight. They're celebrating if their team is doing well. If they're not doing so well, uh, they might be putting down the bottle a little bit more hard. But today is the largest consumption day for alcohol in the U.S., or at least one of them. And police are saying if you're going to even pick up one single drink, don't get behind the wheel. If you plan on letting a little loose today, police want you to know, fans don't let fans drive drunk. There's a friend of mine I know is drinking. I call him, I make sure, and if I'm with him, I take his keys. In the U.S. last year, 40% of all fatalities on Super Bowl Sunday were related to DUI. Uh, typically on Super Bowl Sundays, a lot of partying, uh, a lot of celebration, which is uh, fine, uh, except uh, we don't want people who are driving to be uh, drinking or intoxicated. That's why police have set up DUI checkpoints and are out in full force in effect from north of L.A., Thousand Oaks, and south to Orange County. Patriots, baby! This is our year! Many fans say they plan to head to make sure they don't drink and drive. We're, uh, we're like nine blocks away so we can walk or we rode our bikes here. So we didn't drive for sure. All right, just because you, just you don't see any DUI checkpoints out here right now doesn't mean police aren't out in full force. They are out in maximum force tonight, scouring the streets, looking for impaired drivers. Now, coming up tonight, if you're hosting a Super Bowl party, we're going to give you some tips on how to make sure your guests stay home safe. That's coming up around 645, so stay tuned for that for your KTLA News. I'm Christina Pascucci, live in Santa Monica. Back to you, Rick and Mary Beth. Fans don't let fans drive drunk. It's part of a nationwide effort by police to stop Super Bowl fans from drinking and driving. We tell you all about it coming up in just a few minutes. If you're hosting a Super Bowl Sunday party today, we have tips to make sure all your guests get home safe. And Christina Pascucci live in Santa Monica will have that report for you coming up. Uh, Steve, thanks. As we said before, law enforcement agencies all across Southern California joining forces right now this Super Bowl Sunday night, and they're targeting DUI drivers. KTA's Christina Piscucci, she is live in Santa Monica with a stern warning and safety tips. Hey, Rick and Mary Beth, where people are celebrating all over the country today, one of the biggest celebrations of the year, but police are taking this really seriously. In fact, last year in the U.S., 40% of all fatalities on U.S. on a Super Bowl Sunday were related to DUI. So that's why patrol is up, not only with checkpoints, but agencies across Southern California. They're really putting all of their manpower on this, uh, on the streets to watch for impaired drivers. I spoke with the owner of one local bar here in Santa Monica. He says he sees a lot of his patrons are actually drinking responsibly. Most people on days like this don't drive. In fact, I watched them as they came this morning. Most people ride in cabs or walking. Now we're going to give you some tips if you're hosting a party. First, begin serving dessert when you stop serving alcohol so you can kind of get that sugar to soak up all the uh, drinking that's been going on. Also, put up a list of local taxi companies people can use. Find a sober designated driver to take your guests home. Also, have uh, collect all the keys of your guests to make sure they can't get in the car even if they don't plan on drinking and driving. Now, as we're showing you the streets here, you might not see a DUI checkpoint as you're going around, but that does not m mean that police are not in full force. It's going to be in effect till about 8 o'clock tonight. Satur saturation patrols, police looking for impaired drivers, so just be cautious of that. I'm Christina Pascucci, live in Santa Monica for KTLA 5 News. All right, Christina, thank yeah, you for that. Got to plan ahead. Yeah. All right. Well, Vanessa... Warning for drivers hitting the roads. We have details in moments. So, Jimmy, thank you for that. If you get your Super Bowl spirits out of a bottle and then get behind the wheel of a car, you need to watch out tonight for sure. A combined force of law enforcement officers is cracking down on DUI drivers even as we speak. KTLA's Christina Pascucci live in Santa Monica tonight with more on the warnings and the safety tips. Hello, Christina. Hey, Rick. Well, today, definitely one of the biggest drinking days of the year across the country. You can see a, a lot of people feeling very festive behind me, these Giants fans here in Santa Monica continuing the celebration. But police say they have a very serious message for Super Bowl fans. If you've been drinking, don't get behind the wheel. Now, if you're hitting the roads anytime soon or headed home, uh, which I hope none of these guys are, just be aware there are DUI checkpoints and saturation patrols throughout the night. So just be careful for that. I'm going to get out of here while I can. I'm Christina Pesky to reporting live for KTLA 5 News. Back to you guys. The uh, drinks keep flowing tonight and people celebrating the Super Bowl win. We have a stark warning for drivers hitting the roads. We'll tell you all about that coming up in minutes.
Gucci in Santa Monica. The Super Bowl long over, but the celebrations continue. Now police have a serious warning for drivers hitting the roads. We'll tell you all about that coming up. Of course, more on the warnings and the safety tips. Christina. Well, Rick, Mary Beth, it's a school night, but people still out either celebrating the Giants' win or lamenting the Patriots' loss at 8 o'clock, but police still out patrolling the streets, and uh, we're here live in Santa Monica at O'Brien's. I don't know if you could hear the designated driver. We'll have the updated numbers for you in terms of people who are arrested for drinking and driving over the weekend. I'm Christina Pascucci in Santa Monica. Rick, Mary Beth, back to you.